Hey, welcome to my channel, Days with Dawn. Uh, this is going to be my first video ever. I have filmed and filmed and filmed and have not edited a thing. So bear with me as I learn the editing world. It's quite difficult. I will be doing an intro to my channel uh, video just to kind of give you an idea of where I'm coming from with this channel. Um, kind of really don't even know but anyway we'll go there and in a separate video and so my intro to this was a grocery haul that I did last week today I'm gonna do a little fill-in and I'm going to have my toes done with my mother-in-law and my mother so I may put a little clip of that in there somewhere um, so when I get back I will complete the grocery haul edit the video and try to get it up within this weekend it's a very scary thing for me. This is something new. And like I said, I will go into that with my introduction to my channel video. So as for now, we will see y'all in a bit. So let's get started with this after Christmas pre New Year's grocery haul. Tomorrow's New Year's Eve. I'm having to buy eggs and it hurts so bad. It's $22 for the 60 count of eggs and I have chickens and I just spent $50 on feed. So, you know, it's kind of a little bit annoying, but hopefully they're gonna start laying again soon as the days start getting a little bit longer. And then I bought a few Christmas half off items, just, you know, some ribbons for packages and some name tags and, I noticed I was low on Christmas cookie sprinkles, and I just thought this was pretty potpourri, and I could use this for just um, all winter. And I needed some salt and pepper shakers. I have these with the metal lid, but my sea salt rusted the lid, and I cannot get the lid off of it. And then these, I don't really, I don't really know how much I spent for them, but I've been wanting these. For, uh, baking cookies on and so I got I picked up two of them <clears throat> we're gonna spin it around to the dog getting into I'm sure there was chicken in that bag that's about Mount Bagmore because that's my whole mound of Walmart sacks so anyway and one's eating Kleenex or toilet paper so we'll move it on around to their items because they caused me to buy more items Lint rollers, because I'm fighting a losing battle with dog hair. A long-haired German Shepherd and a Golden Retriever. It's a lot, y'all. <laughs> it's driving me insane. Also got me a furniture protector. I have one already. But I wanted another one so I can kind of switch them out when one's washing, you know, the whole thing. Because it just, it really is my pet peeve. I got some cotton rounds for cleaning off eye makeup remover, um, some nail polish remover. I've talked about this before, but you probably have not seen that since I hadn't didn't post the video. But anyway, $13 for this, but it's this wonderful deodorant. It It is just really good. Long full. I got a new shower curtain because my shower liner is getting nasty. And I got new curtains in my bedroom, but they're kind of out from the wall a little. And so it's letting a lot of light in right into our eyes. And so I'm gonna put this up underneath it to kind of block out some of the light. And then we move on to the food. So we got us some keto bread and just regular bread and low carb flour tortillas. We got pineapple and lettuce romaine lettuce and iceberg lettuce and baby greens because I'm fixing to start eating my salads again. Tomatoes, little cucumbers, a big cucumber, green onions, celery, all the peppers. This is a restock poppy seed dressing. I put it in my chicken salad and it is like fat-free, sugar-free dressing, and it tastes really good in chicken salad. Restock on olives, a restock on Worcestershire, barbecue sauce, soy sauce, instant mashed potatoes. All of these are restocks. Um, 
like the Walmart brand of Rotel. I've got tomato sauce, cream of mushroom soup, green beans. We love these seasoned French style green beans. We got whole green beans, um, more canned chicken because I've been using my canned chicken and Skippy peanut butter. I, I got Skippy peanut butter on accident one day and it is so good. So now I'm kind of hooked on Skippy peanut butter and some bananas. You have to pardon the mess on my table. Like I said, it's after Christmas, pre-New Year's, and it was my mother's birthday yesterday, and she forgot her flowers and her cup. And we have junk everywhere. Got me a pack of gum, party pizzas for one of the grandsons that has at least one party pizza a day, and French toast sticks. And they also, the grandkids, love the seasoned curly fries and the dino nuggets. Got to have those in the freezer. And we got some sausage, some Asian stir fry. Sorry. Low battery. Wouldn't imagine that. Um, French style green beans or whatever those are. Butter. I have some butter, but I just got another one so I don't run out. Heavy whipping cream, because I've been doing whip, um, cream in my coffee instead of coffee creamer with all the junk in it. And it really does seem like it's helping me balance my blood sugar just a little bit. Pimento cheese. I'm going to do something with this ham on New Year's Day with some ham and greens. Um, fake cheese, but I do like me a fake grilled cheese sandwich. <laughs> Sliced baby Swiss. Uh, Colby Jack. Black Forest Ham, Sausage Links, Jimmy Dean Sausage. Ha! Disclaimer, I have been an Owen Sausage girl for years and years, and I got some Jimmy Dean the other day, and I was like, mmm. So, I don't know if Owen's has changed something, but Jimmy Dean is where it's at right now for me. So, there we go with that. These are um, thinly sliced chicken breasts and chicken tenderloins, and boneless, skinless chicken thighs, and chicken breasts, and skin-on, bone-in chicken thighs. I got some drumsticks back there, some onions, some avocado. I just went crazy with the chicken this time because I have zero chicken. I have one whole chicken that we butchered in my freezer, and that's it. I have used up all my chicken. Chip department at Walmart was terrible today, but anyway, I ended up with barbecue and salt and pepper, um, what do you call those, pork rinds, and just some dipping chips. They didn't have any good flavors. So, there we are with all the grocery haul. And now we have another one going through the sacks. I said, give me all the chicken. So we'll see if I can get to this week as I prepare some of the meals out of this, if I can um, get a video going of that. It's been about a week since I did my grocery haul. So I went today for a fill-in. Just little things here and there that we needed. Uh, some kitty litter because they didn't have it the last week. Two 60 count eggs. We have an extra refrigerator, so I have room for these. They were a great price considering Walmart had them for 25 something. And the store that I went to had them for $12.98, which was actually a mismark because the tag said $18.98. So I picked up two because we go through a lot of eggs. Bananas, some cucumbers, because the last cucumber I got froze in my extra refrigerator. So I had to get some cucumbers. I got some blackberries, raspberries, blueberries, strawberries. Walmart had this pure maple syrup for nine bucks. So I picked up a maple syrup and some yogurt. So that's it for my fill-in grocery haul. Also went with my mother-in-law and my mother and we had a pedicure after going to three nail salons. <laughs> we finally found one that was open and so yeah, we had our toes done. 
So that is that. And so my next video will be the meals that I've prepared using the food that I've bought in the grocery haul. Hello, welcome to my channel, Days with Dawn. Um, why won't my volume work? Welcome to Days with Dawn. I am, um, no. Welcome to Days with Dawn. This is my first video ever, and so it's going to be a grocery haul video. In my next video, I will be doing the, um, 